Yo, it's your boy DT here at the Double Trouble Academy camp here at North Cross High School in North Cross, Georgia. And right now I'm sitting down with one athlete who participated in the camp. What's your name, young man? My name is Yusuf Alter. All right. What class are you? Class of 2025. What school you attend? I attend Burkmore High School. And what's, what position you play? I played a one or two. Okay, man. Well, I appreciate you taking a quick moment to sit down with me for an interview. For sure. Before we get jump into these questions, you don't played in three games this weekend. How do you think you performed overall? I think I performed strong. I like to do the little things. Um, and that becomes like, admit, my bad. I like to rebound. I like to defend. And then I, my layups, I start inside. Then I like to get to the mid range and I work my way outside and work on stuff like that. Okay. Out of the three games you played in this weekend, which game do you think you performed in the best? Uh, probably my last game that I just played. Uh, I got a, I got a, my picture taken, and I played a quite a quite a good amount of time. Okay. Awesome, man. So what made you decide to pick the Double Trouble Academy camp to showcase your skills? So I just attended Bergmar like three weeks ago, and my one of my coaches, his name is Mark Livingston, he told me to come by the camp and showcase my talent because I don't really have a name for myself in Georgia. And this is my second showcase so far, and that's why I came. And where are you from originally? I'm from New York, Staten Island, New York. Oh, okay, Staten Island. What made you make this move down to Georgia? Um, opportunities. Where I come from, ain't, there's not that many opportunities because there's, New York is big on basketball. And my school where I came from, it's not it's not really a basketball school. It's mainly education. And my uncle, which is Sean, his name is Sean, he, he told my parents to come down here for better basketball opportunity. And the uh, Berkman High School, like, their whole team and new coaching staff just came. So and he knew them. So that's why I came to Berkman. Okay. And um, what do you think about the talent so far compared to here in New York? Um, it's definitely different. New York is more of, like, I would I, I wouldn't say fancy, but it's 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 different. Over here is mainly athleticism. You rely on athleticism. Over there is mainly ball handle, aggressiveness. And over here, I realize that I'm not gonna say they're not aggressive, but they're a little less aggressive, and they don't do the little things that we do up there. Okay, okay, cool, man. Over the past 12 months, since this time last year, when you was in New York to now, how do you think your game has grown and evolved? What has changed? I would definitely say my confidence has increased. My height, I, I, I got stronger. I like built into my body more. So it able is it been able for like it's easier for me to get to the basket. My shot opened up because I, I'm able to get to the basket. And if you leave me open, I'm gonna knock it down. But I would say my pull up jumper for sure. My ball handle got stronger. Okay. Where do you look to take your game to in the next 12 months, and how do you plan to get there? I would like to build my athleticism. I'm not, I don't really jump that high, but I'm working on that for sure. My speed is there, but I want to get faster. And really, that's it. Just the little thing, strength, jump higher, and be quicker. And the, what I would do to get there, we work out before school, during school, and after school, and just recovery as well, like running hills, um, quick quick wind sprints, uh, vertimax, stuff like that, and then recovery, ice baths, sauna, stuff like that. Got you, man. What do you think about the overall talent this weekend you have seen at the showcase? Uh, it's, de it's definitely it's definitely good competition out here. I'll say that for sure. Um, obviously, it's a showcase, so you, you don't really look to pass. You look to showcase your own abilities. But I, I, I feel like if they pass the ball more and, and, like, use their team, they will look a little better. Like, some of these kids are good, but they, they make themselves look worse when they keep taking every shot. Got you, got you, man. I respect that on that. Yeah. Let's have a little fun real quick. So if you could see any NBA player that you try to duplicate, mimic, or you look up to their style and play, who would it be, whether it's past and present, and why? Oh, uh, that's tough. That's tough. Uh, you see, I have my favorite player was LeBron, but he's 6'9", so, like, that's not realistic. Uh, but I would say Luka Doncic for sure because I'm not, like I said, I'm not that athletic. I'm not the fastest. But I will say I, I'm, I'm smart. I box out, I pass, I do a lot of the little things, and I know how to get a bucket when it's needed. So I would say Luka Doncic for sure because he's great at that. Okay. Current NBA players on it, current ones. Tell me your starting five at every position. If you're the coach and you're picking these players up to play for you, who's your starting five? Uh, um, I'm going to start with Biggs. Biggs, I'll take I'll take probably Jan, nah, Jokic. Jokic for sure. 
Uh, so you playing him? You put him at the five? Yeah, yeah, for oh, sure. So He's gonna be my five. Who gonna be your power four? My power four will be. I wouldn't really know if people say he's a power forward, but Giannis, I'll put Giannis as my power forward. Giannis to me is actually a power forward. That's my yeah. favorite player. He's a power forward. Yeah. Even though he's played small forward, he's a power forward. But go ahead. Yeah, so my small forward would obviously be LeBron, which is tough because KD is – nah, it would definitely be LeBron. He's my favorite player. He's dominant. You can't really you – can't, he's strong and he's a leader. So. Well, you know you can't put LeBron at the one put uh, – yeah, but I want I want Curry too. Okay. There. Yeah. Well, you can put Curry, LeBron in. Um, oh yeah, 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 I can do that. Yeah, small forward, LeBron. I mean, small forward, KD, shooting guard will be Curry, and then LeBron will be my one. Okay. See, I helped yeah. you out on that, man. Yeah, right. good looking. <laughs> no problem. No problem. Okay, Georgia edition only. Start, bench, and cut. And I like the fact that you're not from here, so you go keep it 100 with me. Because yeah, some right, of these people, right. some of these players this weekend wasn't keeping it 100 yeah. with me on that. <laughs> Anthony Edwards, Jalen Brown. Sharif Cooper, NBA level, who you starting, who you benching, who you cutting? Oh, this is tough. You said Jalen Brown, Anthony Edwards, Sharif Cooper, right? Yes. Start, bench, cut. I'm cutting Sharif Cooper. I'm okay. starting Anthony Edwards, and I'm benching Jalen Brown. Got you, man. Yeah. Okay, so last question. What can we expect from you this upcoming high school season at Burkmark for your first year? And you are class in 2025, so this is your senior year. What can we expect from you? So, uh, in New York, I had I had like 1450, like that's how much points I had. So coming here, I'm looking to get my 2000. That was my dream over there. That's mm. the one thing I really wanted to do. So I'm looking forward to get that. And I'm just trying to I'm trying to keep the the winning the winning, not I wouldn't say winning record, but like the winning uh, legacy in a way because the whole coaching staff and the whole team is gone. So like it's really it's really gonna be built around me. So I just don't want to let them down. So I'm I'm gonna keep that up. That's really that's really it. I'm I'm trying to average like 20 points, uh, somewhere from eight to 10 rebounds, and like four assists as a two. Gotcha, man. Well, I do appreciate you taking a quick moment to sit down with me for an so, interview. Um, look forward to making. I'm glad you made that move to come down here to get showcase your skill set. You got a great coach, Mark, and one of the best I've been watching. I know Mark for the last five, six years, and I def definitely got a great coach right there. So I wish you the best of luck this year. Um, Burke Mark, and hopefully, y'all get to that state title and win that championship your senior year, man. For sure, no problem, man. Thank you once again. Thank you, sir.